Hi there. Wondering where you can find some good candidates for love if you're saying, where are all the good ones? Are they all taken? Are there any left? Well, here's a fun tip that I like to share with my clients that helps stretch out the space of possibility and actually help us get out of where we may be locked into this is the kind of person that I want or this is my type that may keep you from missing out on some really amazing potential partners. So imagine that you're out in the world. So if you are a woman who is seeking a man, you can imagine when you're out in the world looking at different men that you see and specifically doing this exercise with someone who may not be your type. So the kind of person that's not, oh, wow, that person is so hot. I totally would love to date someone like that. You want to go with the person who seems kind of average or not really someone you would turn your head for. So you find someone like that and in your imagination, just imagine layering all of the qualities that you would love to have in a person. The things that actually really matter. When I say that, I mean that we're not talking about six foot tall, brown eyes, um, you know, athlete, whatever those physical things are that may be what you think you require. And look at what qualities really are essential to creating the life that you want to have with someone. The kindness, the caring, someone who is not playing games, someone who adores you, someone who makes you feel special, someone who is available, someone who is emotionally healthy and physically healthy. All of the things that you know that matter to you. And this may be slightly different for different people, but generally people want these qualities. And for me, I imagine creativity and having a really matched sense of humor and someone who adores animals. So there then, then there are specific things that you desire that maybe someone else wouldn't want that come with the lifestyle and the character that you are. So imagine that. So I've done this many times where I've been sitting in a coffee shop, even already being in a relationship and just trying it out where I see someone who seems, you know, just like a, a man. And then I start layering these qualities on and asking myself, if I met this person, they had all of these qualities, could I imagine being attracted to this person? And the answer is always yes, that I'm so surprised how different the experience is when I'm focusing on what truly matters for me and what matters in creating a conscious, caring, loving, soulful, connected, super loved kind of relationship. So I encourage you to consider this because if you're online dating and you're using some of these these superficial qualities or or requiring that you have this immediate attraction to someone, you are missing out on amazing candidates. So try this on. You can start by asking yourself, what are those qualities? What are those values? What uh, What is the love relationship I want to have? And write down those qualities and then play this game out in the world or online when you're shopping the online dating sites and see what happens. When you're using this online, you can read and see where people do share some of their values unless they don't write anything. But when you find those people that match your values and maybe the way they look isn't exactly your type, play with this because this is a really powerful tool to help you 
um, open up to new possibilities without sacrificing who you are. Because ultimately, if you're attracted, you're attracted. And sometimes you don't know ahead of time what's going to generate that in your body, in your being. And I've had so many people, including myself at times in different relationships where I didn't exactly think, oh, I'm attracted to this person until I got to know them. And then I was really attracted. So this is really fun to play with. Thanks for being here. And check out getsuperlove.com if you want more information or message me if we haven't met yet. I would love to get to know you better. Talk to you soon. Bye, everyone.